It took a dramatic three-point shot by senior Randy Thompson in five extra minutes. But when the Red Hawks beat Lone Star on Saturday, it sealed their trip to San Antonio where they will play Kerrville Tivy tomorrow night. It's the second time in four years the team has advanced to the state tournament. But for head coach Ross Reedy, Thompson's shot is unlike anything he's experienced. And for me, for that little brief 12 seconds, I wasn't a coach, I was a fan. And so for me, it was just, wow, this is unbelievable. I've not been around, a, I've been around this game for a long time as a player and as a coach, and I've never been a part of anything on any side, loser or winner of anything like that. And so it was blank initially, and then after that it was, I know we're not going to lose now. It was back and forth the whole game, but going into that, especially going back, going back into our huddle, Randy's, got, Randy's tearing up, and KK, who we've, is becoming more and more of a leader as the season's progressed, is shutting everybody up and telling them, hey, we still got time, we still got time, we still got work to do. And I just knew that, hey, we're, it's going to be a fun overtime. While the outcome of any season is always unknown, reaching state has been a goal since the team's first practice in October. I mean, it was definitely one of our goals at the beginning of this year, and we just like had to keep working hard every single day to like achieve it. And I think what Randy said, like towards the middle year, we started to realize like how talented and good we were, and so it definitely became like a reality, especially beyond the playoffs. Although the game is 300 miles away, the team hopes to keep preparation as routine as possible. You know, you, you try to get the most out of every day and you try to stay as routine as possible. So tomorrow we get up and we practice and then we just happen to take an extra long bus ride. Although the team will try to keep their routine, the ultimate goal is winning. The, the hard part is reminding yourself that, look, we're here to win basketball games. We're not here to be in the Alamo Dome. We're not here to, and so for the, you know, we're not here to go to the Riverwalk. And uh, keeping that in mind, which I know that our kids will, I mean, there's full intention on going there and being successful. It's definitely the goal. Um, you know, Coach Reedy prepares us really well for all of our games, and so we're very confident going into this game. And um, I think we have a really good shot of winning it. Um, I don't want to say expecting. We're definitely going to work. I mean, we want to win for sure, but, like, winning is always the goal. We're just going to make sure that we got to do what we got to do to get the job done. But for six seniors on the team, the road to state is familiar. It's going to help us a lot. You know, freshman year, we were really overwhelmed and, like, not surprised that we made it there, but, like, like I said, just overwhelmed. And I think now it's like we know what to expect and, like, know that it's basically just another game just in a different gym. And I think it'll really, like, work to our advantage. It definitely will help because when we got there, we were just so, like, we were so surprised and, like, the, um, like the atmosphere there and, I think it kind of, I don't want to say it messed with the way we played, but we definitely were like super more, like very excited and not expecting how it was going to be. But I think now that we know, um, like kind of know what we're going to see, I think it'll be better for us and we'll be more prepared. Reporting for WTV, I'm Isabella Santiago.